Hello, Sagittarius, and welcome now to Thursday. Sunny and chatty for the archers. The moon is in aqua, putting emotions and intellect side by side. So you're reflecting, you're thinking about how you feel, and your feelings are triggering thoughts, and your thoughts are triggering uh, your, feel, your, uh, your feelings. And that's always the case, but right now, particularly so. This is an excellent time to see a therapist, get something off your chest, have a good conversation with a BFF, see a practitioner, all of the above. Really articulating your feelings is what this is about and seeing how the two co-trigger one another. Now, zoom into the sun. It's your birthday period and we're in chapter two of Sun in Sagittarius. Today, Saturn is ruling the day, which means it's time to make some decisions. In your case, what you are not, all right? I am not this and I am not that. I used to be, but I'm not anymore. In chapter two, we are absolute now with what you're not, what your character won't do, how you will not respond to things. And this kind of retroactively is pointing towards what you are. And that's what we're going to work on in the next 10 days, manifesting the new Sagittarius kind of charisma and personality for 2011. And Mars, Mars has hopped over the border into Capricorn. That means you're going to have a lot of aggressive masculine energy available to you to raise soul capital, to get work done, to manifest abundance. And abundance and soul capital are a big topic this year. Mercury goes retrograde next week in this space, but Mars is there to give you courage and strength and determination. That begins now. Now, you might be feeling a little bit of an energy loss with Mars moving out of your sign, by the way. Just a little bit of transition. It's not that you're too tired. It's that you lost Mars. And it's Thursday. We've got Sadiqa Salter's Renegade Aromatherapist going live today. She has got another plant essence. It vibrates in the Sagittarius plane. She's here to let the plant kingdom help you do what you do best, expand, adventure, and also learning and teaching. So these plants that she's chosen do vibrate with Sagittarius, and she's live everywhere, Soul Garden Streams. All right, Sag, that's all I have for today. Tomorrow we talk about Uranus Direct. Until then, live, love, be. Soul.